<clears throat> One month now. Five to go. I find I've found myself in a predicament. I'm enjoying my time with Fang. Most of the time, just talking about stupid shit. Like our mutual love for Wire 2 and comedy movies. We are both ventriloquists, ventriloquists, ventriloquists. We are both ventriloquists. We practice every day. He carries a basket. He carries a paper roll. We don't have cysts. But there is one thing that's for sure, my friend. We are ventriloquists. Almost every day now, I'm either at her desk helping her in science, or working on a lab with her. Or she sat next to me deciphering the mythical, uh, mystical arts of not sucking at music. I'm talking more with her than anyone I've ever talked with. Ever. Not to mention lunch and after school. It's less hiding from the tangerine tyrant and the seer these days and more spending time with Fang and Reed. Even if he's constantly checked out and smells of burnt skunk. The fuck is he on anyway? It's Carfe, bro? I don't know, I'm dumb. What? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Bang and the gang. Heh. <laughs> are pretty alright. Trish, though. Every day she gives me the same look of distrust and a put upon sigh. As if I'm some kind of chore to deal with. Whatever. It's, it's not like she matters in the long run. But I find myself having these weird thoughts lately. Like, is it any of this real or not? <clears throat> I tumble backwards off the stage off of the stage. Whoa. Ow. Bro. That sucks. <laughs> That would be me. My response would be, damn, that's crazy. Mm -hmm. It's lunchtime now, and I guess I dozed off. Too many late night study sessions. You like, need help? Just fix the projector read. Okay, almost done. I hobble to my feet. Feeling out the bruise blossoming on my shoulder. Err. Stupid fucking stage. Stupid stage, you make me look bad! I consider jumping back up, but find the stairs more up, more appealing. Appealing. <clears throat> the path is blocked. Going up the stairs, Trish suddenly grabs my shoulder, pinning it to the wall. She leans in close, looking me dead in the eyes. Uh, can I help you? Don't play dumb. Something's up with Fang today. She gestures to where Fang is sitting. Fang's picking at her lunch with a fork, not eating a bite. Now that I think about it, she has been a bit distant lately. Like, no, just... They've been like this since band practice yesterday? Wait, what? Did you do something to them? Do something? What does she mean? She doesn't think Fang and I... Boy. What? No. I don't think at least. Why are you so concerned? Everyone has a bad day every now and then, right? Fang and I have been friends for ten years now. Not once have I seen them this upset. You're the only new thing around here. It can't be anyone else. 
so... What did you do? I swear I haven't done anything with Fang. Look, we've got music next. I'll ask Fang what's up then. Trish... Flowers? Glowers? Flowers. Glowers. Trish Glowers. We both glance at Fang to see her still sitting there with her untouched food. You'll talk to Fang? You'll probably make it worse. I should be the one to talk with them. So why haven't you? Trisha's mouth shuts with a click. I stare her down. Her eyes harden and she finally speaks. Fine. You better not fuck it up. She lets go of my shoulder, stuffing her hands in her jacket pockets with a huff. I finally return to where I was sitting on the stage to continue finishing my lunch. Right where I plant myself on the ground, Reed speaks up. And... done. Done. With the projector? That's right, man. Now we can watch movies, shows, pornos, all that. I don't think about that. I don't think that third one's correct. We're not watching porn in school. Not with that attitude. <laughs> Trish throws an orange slice at me. So, what do you guys want to watch? I can't think of anything that would be appropriate not around normal high schoolers. <coughs> Trish raises her hand and jumps in place. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> oh, I know that one. The actors in that one are pretty great. Oh yeah, I love the boy the VA work. <laughs> Trish and Reed stop and stare at me. Crap, was it something I said? What? Saved by the uh, 6 a.m. bell again. Saved by the bell. I look to Fang and... Oh. When did she leave? Oh, Fang left already. I'll go catch up with her. Bye! I make record time out of the auditorium, leaving a still confused Trish and Reed. Fang isn't in music class when I get there. I tap out a quick message to her phone, to her on my phone. I take a spot next to her seat and wait. Maybe she just needed to use the bathroom. It's been about 20 minutes. I'm starting to get worried. Something's up with Fang today. Day, 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 day. Hmm. I looked at my phone, and the message I sent her way just before class started. Hey, wanna talk? Still on scene? You better not fuck up. God damn it. Mr. Jingo? I need to use the bathroom. One guitar shaped bathroom pass later, I'm scrambling through the halls. If I were a non binary teenage pterodon having a crisis, where would I hide? Someplace only Fang would go. The family bathrooms! There are only two in the building. I sprint to the first bathroom, closer to the back of the school, and nestled away in the special needs area. My knuckles wrap against the door, locked and preoccupied. Fang, you're missing class, and I seriously need help with this, this sheet music. Is that really what he cares about? Priorities 
Our, right. He's got his priorities. The one you seek is some, is elsewhere. Who the fuck? Wait. You're that weird stego chick. Stella? That's very rude. And I'm not weird. Whatever. Do you know where Fang is? Not here. Can you please leave? I have a nervous bladder. I turn away from the door and sprint to the front of the school where the other bathroom is. It's while I'm moving briskly through the empty corridors of the school with an untuned guitar in hand that I find divine providence. Or rather, the feathers floating by the window provide me with the clue I need. I look out the window and while I can't look up to see for sure, the shadow that she is casting on the ground below is enough verification required. My feet climb the steps easily, but my mind is ill at ease. The hell is wrong with me right now? Why do I feel anxious right now? What did you do? What if, what if I didn't do something? Fang and I have been friends for 10 years now. I've known her for barely a month, and why is it my problem to fix? Not once have I seen them this upset. I can't stop gnawing the gnawing feeling in my chest. I'm at the door of the roof to the roof now. It's shut, but by the handle I notice a piece of cardboard tucked between the door and frame, <sighs> keeping the latch open. Good job, dork. Fang smirks a bit. Damn it all. Fang's problems first. Then I can figure out my chest. Well, I, I open the door and I am immediately blinded by the sun. I shade my eyes. The door clicks shut behind me. Oh, shit. Oh, it's locked. <laughs> Who's the... Anon, what's with the guitar? Fang is sitting at atop the stair enclosure, looking down at me. Mr. Jingo's hall pass. I, uh, kind of need help with the sheet music again. Damn. He has priorities. He does. Wow, you really suck at music. Yeah, I really do. At least he's honest. I find the ladder easily enough to cl and climb on top of the tiny hut. Around Fang are scattered feathers. You alright? The fet preening? What? Fang sighs. She ho she holds one of her wings and gently brushes her fingers through the feathers. I'm preening my wings. Don't answer that Oh my god. Fly <laughs> what did you just say? He said fly, fly broken, broken wings. Wing. <laughs> she winces. A feather drips to the floor. That looks painful. A little. Is this like Dino Period? Shut up. I sit down Thank next you. to her and look out at Vol Volcadera Bluff. It's a beautiful view. It's a distraction. You ever... Yes. <laughs> don't you ever. Man, don't you just ever. I think Maybe staying quiet big. would help, because I have no idea what they're talking about yet. There's a time to speak, and a time to listen. You ever feel like you, you just don't matter? Fang stares at the vista of Volked Volcadera, but her eyes are vacant. 
I feel like no matter what I do, I'll never be able to make something. I try and try, but nobody likes the wet phase I express myself. She growls. Not once, after all the work I've put into Verm. I think it's supposed to be Verm. I think, yeah, because the two a BB. Bs make a W. Worm drama. Has anyone ever told me it was good? Her eyes wetten. Her voice roughens. Her shoulders quake. Nobody's ever said, good job, Fang. Can I get a copy of that last song on CD? What about this? this uh... I've been playing music since I was basically in diapers, and all I have to show for it is a shit reputation. Her hand curls into a fist. Her nails bite into her palm, and I can clearly see the minute trickle of blood. How much harder do I have to try to get people to notice me? Her fist crashes down on the floor. Even my own parents. When dad looks at me, it's like he just sees a lost cause? Oh, Fang is the scene team. Better focus on the one that isn't broken so we don't screw up again. She punctuated her snout shouts with her fist, striking the roof beneath her. Her fist lands softly one final time, uncurling to reveal the blood, the bleeding bruise her sharp nails have left. Watching her break apart, it's causing the dull pain in my chest to intensify. Why can't I be popular like him? Fang deflates completely, all her anger gone, replaced with melancholy. Nasir doesn't have to try at all. Even crippled, he just breezes through life. Why does he get, the sh get straight A's? Why does he get my parents' attention? Why do I have to be the burden on everyone? She grabs her knees and buries her face in her lap. Take fun. Yeah, I feel I like- Maybe, I, I think maybe this is the time you should speak up. That's what I'm stuck between. I feel like I would say something, but just being there for somebody, I think helps a lot more. You know? Yeah, but sometimes also having an input on the uh, people I, can also help. I know, it's just... I think I'm gonna stay quiet. Because I don't know if Fang has more to say, right? Yeah. I would yeah. also interrupt. I would myself. I mean, I think I'll just save in case, you know. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna stay quiet. I feel like just being there will help more. Okay, there was more. Okay, there was more. Okay, now I don't feel so bad. And the worst part is he... And the worst part is he can't even hate me. She picks her head up. Rivulets? Self-voicing enabled. Rivulets of... Rivulets. Self-voicing hey, disabled. I'm correct, I'm you correct. Are, uh, rivulets of tears and orange eyeliner run down her cheeks and leave bright stains on her knees. I can tell him to fuck off every day and he'll still be there the next day and the next. As if nothing fucking happened. He's a constant reminder of everything I can't be. He's a goddamned boy scout. Little Mr. Perfect. And I'll always be his fucking shadow. In. I can't just change, just magically get better at everything, 
even if someone like Nasir tries to help, and it's clear he wants to, but the sheer difference between us, it won't ever happen. But my brother tries. He's always trying. <laughs> I mean, that's family. Lovely. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, now, I rem now I remember what training is. What? Kind of like going through your feather and picking him out. That's what training is. Oh, okay. Like, so he just fucks up. Every fucking time. <laughs> she wipes a tear with one of her hands, but leaves a bloody smudge instead. I actually feel a little... I feel bad now. That's of what? But just not it responding? No, just... I'm seeing a mental breakdown. Nasir knows who he is. I don't even know what I am. Do I step in now? Yeah. Yeah. Don't. Don't do it. Don't do it. You can step in now. I just need to think, sorry, hold on. I'm going to stay quiet. Just interrupt, please. But I feel getting every- having someone just listen... Yes, but you... sometimes people are looking for input. They want someone to also speak. Get but I don't opinion. know if she has any more to say. Like, well, getting she... everything off your chest feels better. Yes, but you can also give your input and they can continue. I think I'm just going to stay silent. Dang. Who am I, damn it? I can only define myself by the things I'm not. I'm not good. I'm not a good band player. I'm not a good sibling. I'm not a good friend. I'm not a good person. My mind is Yo. a fucking mess. It's in my Yo, head, it's all. Me. My thoughts, they're all fucking foggy. Half the time, I'm hating myself. Who am I? <clears throat> am I who I say I am? Maybe, not really. The other half, I'm daydreaming of being something special. That I'm different from everyone, above them. I know more than en than them. They're both lies. I'm fucking lying to myself, but... It's, it's like I'm just here to be a drain on myself and others. I'm stuck with myself. I just... I can't just drop everything and try other things now. It's just too late for that. There's too many ways to fuck up. Music is the only thing I've ever been decent at. And even then, she looks at, to me desperately at a loss for words. Now you can use girl. Can I please just say something? She's. Last time, I didn't Please. know if there was anything else on their chest, and yes, they are looking at me, but I don't know if they want to say anything else. Well, Sean. Like, what? Oh, you got interrupted. You got interrupted, dog. Yeah. Alright. Don't let me leave, Murph! <laughs> don't let me leave, Murph! <laughs> no! 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 Here we go. It's never too late to try something new. I can't. I just can't. You have 
You have support from me, Nasir, right? Maybe. Here's what I think. I put my arm on Fang's shoulder. You're in a pretty bad spot right now. Self-improvement is hard, but there's nothing to be gained without sacrifice, right? Fang gives a slight nod. You need to step out of your comfort zone more often, even if you think there's no time. There's no harm in diversifying, right? Fang looks away from the coastline and to me. I don't know. Maybe you're right. You could also try harder to get along with Nasir. I guarantee there's not that much in the way between you two. You'll be there to support me, right? Sure. I don't know if I'm strong enough to do all that. I believe you can be. Being weak is nothing to be ashamed of. Staying weak is. You don't have to do it alone. Fang embraces me tight. <clears throat> Thank you. We sit in silence for a few minutes. Eventually, she lets go. Fang's breathing is evening out, and she looks far more composed now. Hey, can I see that? Fang points to my at my oversized hall pass. Yeah, sure. She takes it from my hands. Our, our fingers brushing for a second. Nope, not a hall pass. She blushes while she handles the acoustic bathroom pass. I think, I think I finally got the tune in on. Tune. She finishes tuning the guitar and tests it. With a nod to herself, Fang begins strumming. The rhythm is slow, and the tone is soft. Enough so that her humming blends perfectly with it. I lean back, bobbing my head along to the impromptu music. The streaks from her tears that had all once... What is it? Ma marred? Marred? Marred. Self-voicing enabled. The streaks yeah, from her tears marred. that had once marred her... Okay, so Self-voicing right disabled. Her pretty face only helped the highlight. Only uh, helped the highlight. You see it, do But I hum along now too, which causes Fang to giggle. The rhythm is slowing to a crawl. The song about to end. With a meteor coming soon, everyone's going to die. So I'll say good. So I'll say to everyone goodbye, volcano high. The lyrics surprise me, but I shrug it off. You ready to get up? Fang nods and wipes her tears one last time with her forearm. I stand and pop my back, looking out over the fence at the ground below. From, he from here I can see the afternoon sun starting to encroach on the skyline of the small coastal town. Turning to Fang, I crouch a bit and extend my hand to her. She moves her bloody hand to take it, but hesitates. She softly grasps my hand. She winces in pain. You know, it's strange. I expected the alarms to go off again, but this feels different, somehow. More natural. I'm careful to hoist her to her feet. Mindful of her injured palm. But her beak accidentally bumps into my cheek on her way up. Ah, there they are. There, there they are. Fang's eyes con contract, contract and she instinctively hops backwards. 
covering her muscle with her hands and turning her head away in flusteration. I clench my lower jaw and look at my palm, slick with sweat and her blood. The silence continues for an immeasurable amount of time. Haha, <laughs> so that's how dinos kiss. Haha. <laughs> no. Fuck, 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 fuck. Haha, <laughs> not really. Haha, <laughs> haha. <laughs> uh, uh, this is just awkward laughter. I look for something, anything, to end this awkwardness. Like the guitar hall pass. Wait. I check my phone, seeing that Mr. Jingo's class will be ending in 10 minutes. Fuck the assignment. Fang finally looks the my way again, though her face is still flush. <laughs> What? Mr. Jingo's assignment. There's no way in hell I'll be able to do it at home. <laughs> Fang hands... Fang's hands try to cover her beak, failing horribly to contain her giggles. <laughs> God, you really suck at music. I glare at her. Huh. Why don't you just drop it? It's an elective anyway. Because I need to maintain my GPA for college. Because oh. I kind of like it? Oh, the GPA would not matter when you enter college. My, I blush and I, I blush and look down to the entrance of the roof below us. Of, a, of the roof below us. Hmm. Maybe I'll help you. Fang hops down, her wings easing her landing. I owe you for the fucking therapy session anyway. Oh, thank fuck. I climb down the ladder. Those wings must be really convenient. Who the fuck is up there? Holy shit! The door flies open, off its hinges through the suicide fence and over the side of the building, crashing loudly on the concrete below. I know someone is ditching up here. My hunting instincts can tell. Oh, devil fuck. Uh, you. Principal Spear looks at me, looks at us. Finger pointed at me as if to set f uh, to fire a special beam cannon through my chest. Special beam cannon! There's the Dragon Ball reference. In all my goddamned years, on top of the roof, explain now. Bullshit mode activate. I got lost looking for the bathroom. Yeah. Spears incinerates me on, on the spot. Estra season? For a brief instant, I picture Fang in a bikini. No, no we're not doing this yes, again. Yes, yes. <laughs> Hot. Hot. I, I... That was not me, that was the character in it. Fang gets a similar stare and withers down. I'm not stupid. Tarot Estrus season isn't for another few months. Wait, I just realized, I, is the guy on the right meant to be like, like, uh, like a Neanderthal? Wait, is that primal? It just hit me. Wait a minute. Empty your pockets now. I reduced myself to Hoover flags. All I had on me was my phone and a ratty wallet held together with hot glue and duct tape. Fang does the same, dropping her own phone, a spare guitar pick, and an unopened pack of cigarettes. Spear looks at Fang dead in the eyes, rips the package open, and stuffs every cigarette in his mouth at once. He eats it. Yeah. To our mortified stares, 
he chews them until they are a brown glob and spits it over the fence, landing on a rather oriental looking car. Anon, go to class now. Fang to the nurses. I look to Fang one last time. She looks a mess. Her wings are ragged, feathers misaligned, and a clear patch of them missing on one. Stains on her legs from her makeup, tears, and blood. Drying blood on her hands, arms, and beak. Eyes puffy and red from crying. But her smile was... I wave her goodbye and wordlessly return to class. I only have a few minutes, but I can't focus on the assignment. I'll have to take it at, I'll have to take it home as homework. Hmm. Maybe I'll help you. I take out my phone and consider messaging Feng again. Please do not. My heart thumps roughly in my chest. Just what is with me today? All this drama. When did my life become a soap opera? Heh. <laughs> Even included a dramatic kiss. I look at my hand, her blood now dried and dusty on my palm. Did that count as a kiss? I don't think I so. I mean, it was unintentional. She backed off and all. Jeez, my insides feel like liquid. Surely that was just my disgusted reaction to Spears' scared scare tactics up there. Nah, this isn't fear. I'm like a bottomless pit. The feeling is pleasant. Yeah, I kind of like it. Hmm. I wonder if Fang. The feeling intensifies, but why? I only thought of, it's not as if she, but. Do I like Fang? No. I don't fucking know, I'm not you. Do ya? Do ya? Fuck. <laughs>